now let us discuss about conversion of finite automata into regular expression so here the input is finite automata whereas the output is regular expression uh, totally three steps are there let us see the first step construct state equation for all the states based on the incoming edges so here first we have to construct state equation for all the states based on the incoming edges and the second point is add epsilon to the equation of the initial state so for uh, the initial state state equation we have to add the epsilon third step is simplify the equation by using with ordens algorithm here uh, we are converting the finite automata into the regular expression by using with ordens algorithm simple one so q not here q not is both initial state as well as final state so if we apply zero on q not we will move to q1 next q1 on one means q not next q not on one means q2 q2 on zero means q not next q2 on one means q3 next self loop zero one q1 on 0 means q3 so q0 on 0 means q1 next q1 on 1 means q0 next q0 on 1 q2 q2 on 0 q0 1 q3 0 0 1 okay let us solve this problem so first we have to write state equation so what is the initial state q0 q0 is equal to so what are the incoming edges for q0 uh, this is the incoming edge this is the incoming edge so this edge represents q1 into 1 q1 into 1 plus this edge means q2 into 0 so we have only two incoming edges q11 q20 plus for the initial state we have to add the epsilon next q1 what is q1 what are the incoming edges we have only one incoming edge that is q0 into 0 q0 into 0 next q2 is equal to incoming edges how many edges only one edge that is q0 into 1 q0 into 1 next one q3 is equal to so totally four edges first one q1 into 0 plus second one q2 into 1 third one q3 into 0 plus 1 that is that can be written as q3 0 plus q3 1 so here uh, what is the uh, final state the final state is q0 so now we have to solve q0 state so q0 state equation uh, solution will becomes the regular expression okay here we have four states but out of four states what is the final state the final state is q0 so we have to solve q0 equation so q0 equation produces some regular expression so that will becomes the result okay here uh, ardennes theorem means if the expression if the regular expression is in the form r is equal to q plus rp then we can return this as r is equal to qp star r is equal to qp star this is ardennes algorithm uh, so if you observe q0 here q0 means q11 what is q1 q0 0 only so we can substitute q1 value here uh, that is in the form of q0 only uh, plus q2 0 what is q2 q0 1 so we can substitute here so everything will be in the form of q0 so directly we can solve the problem so q0 is equal to what is q1 substitute q1 in q0 what is q1 q0 into 0 q0 into 0 q0 into 0 into here we have 1 1 plus what is q2 q2 means q0 1 q2 means q0 into 1 and after this we have 0 0 plus epsilon 0 plus epsilon so q0 is equal to a, a between these two terms we can common q0 so q0 into 0 1 plus here we have 1 0 plus here we have epsilon this is in the form of r is equal to q plus rp here what is r value r value is q0 q value is epsilon r value is q0 this is nothing but p 
this is in the form of r is equal to r is equal to q plus rp r value is q naught q naught then we can uh, simplify this as r is equal to qp star what is r value q naught q naught is equal to qp star what is q epsilon into p star what is p 0 1 plus 1 0 whole star q naught is equal to epsilon into r star is nothing but r star only so 0 1 into 0 1 plus 1 0 whole star so this is the regular expression for this finite automata there is no need to solve q3 state q3 there is no need to solve this state equation why because we have to solve only q naught we can solve q naught based on q1 and q2 q1 has q naught state q2 has q naught so directly from them we can solve this one so this is the regular expression for this finite automata now let us solve one more example so that if there are any doubts then those doubts will get clarified okay you can solve any problem in the examination let us solve the second one example 2 example 2 here q1 is initial state q1 self loop 1 means q1 next q1 on 0 means q2 next q2 on 1 q1 next q2 on 0 q3 this is final state 0 1 0 1 okay so q1 on 1 q1 only q1 on 0 q2 next q2 on 1 q1 q2 on 0 q3 q3 on 0 1 means q3 only okay here q3 is the final state so we have to solve q3 state equation that will become q3 state equation result will become the regular expression okay so first uh, let us write the state equations q1 is equal to q1 into 1 plus uh, incoming edge we have one more incoming edge that is uh, q2 into 1 plus uh, q1 is the initial state for the initial state we have to add the epsilon next q2 is equal to q2 is equal to we have one incoming edge that is this edge so what is this edge q1 into 0 q1 into 0 next q3 is equal to we have three incoming edges first one is q2 into 0 plus next one is q3 into 0 plus 1 this can be written as q3 0 plus q3 1 so here what is the final state q3 is the final state so we have to solve q3 state equation now what is q3 q2 we need q2 also what is q2 we need q1 also so first we have to solve q1 here so consider q1 state what is q1 q1 is equal to q11 plus here we have q2 what is q2 q2 means q10 so now substitute q2 value here what is q2 q1 into 0 after this we have 1 plus epsilon q1 is equal to q1 is common term so 1 plus 0 1 plus epsilon this is in the form of r is equal to q plus rp r is equal to so this is q this is r this is p then we can write this as r is equal to q p star q means epsilon into p star means 1 plus 0 1 star so epsilon into r star is nothing but r star so 1 plus 0 1 whole star so q1 value is this regular expression 1 plus 0 1 whole star okay 1 plus 0 1 whole star now we have to uh, solve this one this is the final state here we have uh, uh, what is the final state q3 is the final state q3 is equal to q2 into 0 plus q3 0 yeah let us write here q3 is equal to what is q3 q2 0 plus q3 0 plus q3 1 q3 is equal to what is q2 value q2 value is q10 q2 value is what q10 q2 value is q10 q10 plus here q3 is common so q3 into 0 plus 1 so q3 is equal to what is q1 value we know what is q1 what is q1 1 plus 0 1 whole star 
into G, 1 plus 0, 1 whole star. Here after this we have 0 plus Q3 into 0 plus 1. This is in the form of R is equal to Q plus RP. So, this is R, this is Q, this is R, this is P. Okay. Here uh, we have to produce some constant here. R is equal to Q plus RP. So, we have to arrange like this. So, we can write as R is equal to QP star. What is Q? 1 plus 0, 1 whole star into 0. QP star into what is P? 0 plus 1 whole star. So, this is the regular expression for this problem. So, in this way we can solve any problem very very easily by converting a finite automata into regular expression. Simply we have to solve the final state. So, the final state state equation will become the regular expression.